Good morning, happy Tuesday. Right now, <clears throat> I am on my way to a coffee shop. Um, get me some coffee. I saw this new coffee shop a couple weeks ago um, and I wanted to try it out. So I'm trying it out for the first time today. I have my cleaning people at my house right now, cleaning my house. So yeah, before y'all like, y'all got people in, you got people in your house just, Yes, um, they've been cleaning my house since I literally moved to um, um, Atlanta. Um, I actually met them through my ex because they were cleaning his place and they came and cleaned my place. And then um, once we were living together for a certain point in time, they were still cleaning our place and they've been cleaning for him. We're cleaning for him for over 10 plus years, so. I've just never got anybody new and they are the people that watch Louie so I trust them they're very trustworthy they literally have a key to my house so yeah um, it's very it's it's nice because I'm really spoiled um, they literally come and pick Louie up whenever I go out of town they drop him back off it's clutch <laughs> so I'm very thankful for them and I haven't had my house cleaned um, with them and it's been a little minute um, so I'm excited to really get a deep clean because, you know, I kind of just do like the surface level clean when it comes to my house. Um, yeah, I normally just do the surface level clean because I'm not like a dirty person or anything like that. So it's not much I have to clean except for like the kitchen, my bedroom, living room. But I always I'm very clean, so it's not much that I have to do. Um, I'll map myself here, vacuum and things like that, of course. But like a deep clean of everything all in one day. They're going to get that done for me which I love <laughs> so yeah um, they are at home cleaning um, like I said I'm on my way to a coffee shop and then I have a few errands I need to run because I need to pick up some things that I need for the house like I need a steamer um, I let someone borrow my steamer and I never got it back so I need to go buy a new steamer because I don't own an ironing board I know it sounds crazy but I just like steamers it's just I don't want to keep pulling out an ironing board like I just feel like that's so old school I don't know teach his own I use a steamer, but I will say, I have days where I completely get the whole outfit soaking wet because of the steamer, but it's just because I have the way I have the, the clothes laid or whatever. Anyways, I'm just rambling. So, like I said, it's Tuesday. Um, I'm just casually wearing some nudes today. My hair needs to be done, so I just went ahead and threw a whole bunch of <laughs> dry shampoo in there. And, um... I clipped it up, did half up, half down. The sun was out today, it's literally so gloomy out. It's so gloomy. Um, but it's not cold, it's 61 right now. So I didn't have to wear a big coat or anything. My camera ended up dying literally as I'm smacking my gums, chewing up that yummy food. Because I just got a new little quick meal that I'm probably going to overdo. Cause it's so easy, so quick and so flavorful. Girl. Oh my gosh. Anyways, I'm about to head into the coffee shop. I'm about to pull up in like two minutes. So I'll show you guys, take you guys in. I have to do some German journaling, um, write down some um, things I need to do, get done. So yeah, come along with me.
this does not look appetizing right now, but this is so good, y'all. Y'all know I love a hot dog. And I wanted something sweet. It's so cute in here. I love it. I haven't tried the coffee yet, but I got an iced latte, iced caramel latte with hazelnut syrup and oat milk. The coffee. It's so good. Mm. So good. Just what I needed. This is so good, y'all. Oh. I wish I could try it. I just love anything hot dog. And they have other flavors in there, like spicy ones. There's a lot of general pastries in here. My mom would love this place. I'm not sure if I'm going to bring them here when they come visit me. Lord, y'all, what am I gonna buy today? What am I about to spend all my money on today? Ugh. The, this is literally the first thing you see when you walk in. <laughs> like, give me a second. Damn. So, I was looking for something like this for my bedroom because I wanted something to put maybe in between my two chairs that I haven't put in my bed or kind of on that wall <clears throat> where my curtains are on and the picture frame in between I don't know I don't know y'all it's many bags I don't think I'm gonna get this because I really don't know where I'm going to put it. I really don't know where I'm putting this either. But I'm thinking on top of my dresser. I don't know yet. Alright, so now I am about to head to Sephora to take back this sunscreen um i didn't even really look for it to say sheer but this is definitely not sheer i put it on for the first time the other day um as my last step in my skincare and y'all it's like i'm already pale i don't need any more of that to my face so yeah um, I'm about to head to Sephora and return that. <clears throat> Hopefully I don't, there is, I do want to get that Too Faced blush. Um, if they have it in stock that I haven't seen all over TikTok. I really need to look at my TikTok to see which videos I have saved. Um, to see what else I've been influenced by to buy and spend my money on um, and then I need to go to I think I'm gonna go to like home goods I didn't end up getting that tray or um, the candle holder because oh, see this is why I need to get something to hold my camera <laughs> Um, because if I, they, if they had two of those candle holders, I would have got it, but they only have one. Cause I was thinking maybe I can put them on my, um, 
cabinets that are next to my fireplace um and it doesn't really go with the theme of my room my room is more so on like the modern side not really like light wood colors you know i have a lot of silver going on in there just more modern so i want to keep it like that to kind of separate it from it just everywhere in the house kind of having the same vibe um so i really strictly just want my room to be more on the modern side uh and then the tray i didn't know if i really wanted to put it on my dresser because i don't know how i really, really want to decorate it i could have got it and just took it back but I just had no idea how I really wanted to. I know I would have put a candle on there, but what else would I have put it up there? You know what I mean? I really want minimal in my room, but I also don't want it to look so plain because it does look really plain right now. I really want to find some good artwork to put on each wall, especially the wall that's by my bathroom that y'all mainly see when I'm like by my bathroom. It's just so plain right there. I definitely need something big or like two big picture frames. I also want to get like a little table or something to put in between the windows and I also want to I think I want to take out those gray chairs because it kind of takes up a lot of space so I kind of want just like a simple like maybe little bench um I think that'll be way better than having those two chairs and then I'll just have those two chairs <clears throat> like in my um take them back downstairs in the guest room office space that I'm hopefully going to be working on soon so, yeah, I'm gonna go to uh, Home Goods and I'm gonna go to. Um, I don't know if I want to get some Joe Malone candles or the boutique candles. I'm still deciding. I low key want to get the big black um, diptyque candle to put in my bedroom on my dresser. For sure and I really need to find some mirrors to go next to my um, bed on top of my nightstands like I already took down that black one that was just there that was just too small it was literally just there for no reason it wasn't hung up or nothing it looks so raggedy and janky over there but with it gone now it really makes a huge difference it's just so plain so I really, really need to find. I've been doing my measurements to see if I can order some online, but I just haven't been finding. They have like gold, black ones. I need silver, brass. Yeah, I need silver to kind of get everything to flow. I really didn't like the black with this. I really want to do silver. So, yeah. But right now I am pulling up to Ulta because that was on my to-do list today, so. Pulling up to Ulta. What am I getting in here? What am I getting in here? What am I supposed to be getting in Ulta? Am I supposed to be getting anything? Ah, uh, I know what I gotta get. <laughs> so I just got home. I know I've been MIA, but I'm gonna show you guys what I got today. <clears throat> but I got a really exciting package in the mail. I wanna show you guys what it is go ahead and Ugh, get y'all right so we ordered came pretty quick the oh my hold on a second now i forgot um anyways This is the vanity case from Skims. I'm so excited about this because I just love the color of it. Didn't like the price of it, but oh, fuck. Love the color of it, y'all. And it came very spacious. I needed a new, I don't know if I'm gonna use this as a makeup bag or like, my skincare for when I'm traveling, but you guys, all this space, it's huge. Like what? I probably should have got two, but you know what? I love this because actually I can put all my skincare in here plus body care stuff because sometimes I'll be having to put it separate. 
I'm in love. Great purchase. Oh, I can't wait to fill it up. This is such a cute bag for makeup, travel essentials. Girl, I had to get this because stuff like this, I feel like be going out of stock, be like one time things or going out of stock forever. And it don't come back until six months later. Don't make that time to be in long. I need now. I'm thirsty and I'm about to open up this Snapple Greena. Snapple Greena? Snapple Greena. No, Snapple Greena. Girl, I don't know. This is the Clementine and Peach flavor. I haven't tried this flavor. I've only tried the. Um, these names are crazy. Anyways, I've only tried this flavor. And honestly, y'all, no, I'm a water girl. I'm not really a juice girl. This has 29 grams of sugar. This one has seven. So I'm gonna give that a try. But this is so good. And I feel like, you know what? Sometimes I deserve a little treat. I'm just really that one of those girls where I'm big on, girl, if I drink too much soda, juice, eat too much sweets, I'm gonna get a pimple. And I'll put it. <laughs> I know there's other ways I can get pimples too, but too many sweet sugars, I feel like definitely gives me that. Um, so yeah, I'm thirsty. And I'm about to try this one. So I'm excited. Um, what else? Oh yeah, y'all already saw what I got from Target. If you saw my TikTok. So if you didn't, go ahead and head over and watch it to see what I got. But I also picked up this. I'm gonna just show y'all now. The color is bomb nude black and look i love that and it is recycled stainless steel leak proof dishwasher safe um let's see love that so yeah um i also picked me up i just did spend too much money today y'all some more plugins that i need put them all out um, I'm gonna just show y'all what I got after I get a drink and figure out what I'm about to eat for dinner because I'm hungry. So I'm gonna just get myself together and show y'all what I got, okay? I got me a whole little setup right here, y'all. This one is just regular blood orange and black raspberry sparkling water. This one is the one that tastes more of like a sitsy, a sparkling juice water-ish. This is definitely, I just tried it, and it's more on the lines of sparkling flavored water, for sure. Sparkling green apples, one of my favorites from Trader Joe's, just regular water, no sugars, nothing. I actually haven't tried this, I just bought it. And this one has a little bit of juice, and I really like this. Um, this is from the holidays, though, so I don't know. I don't think they still have this flavor in Trader Joe's, and I had to move this because it was in the way right here. But I love these things, y'all. I only have one left. <laughs> and also this literally tastes like green tea with blueberry and pomegranate. With a dab of blueberry and pomegranate. There's no sweetness to this at all. Y'all, this taco I just made looks crazy. <laughs> but I did some salmon in the air fryer, <clears throat> leftover rice from last night, put lime and cilantro in the rice, cut up some tomatoes. I should have cut up some onions, honestly. Um, sour cream and I put some salsa verde on there so Tabasco this is one of my favorites I put the shell in the air fryer for like three minutes this is the cheese I used and cherry tomatoes because I didn't want to cut my new actual tomato so yeah this is din din for the night Super quick and easy. Got me the green apple flavor. Regular sparkling water with lime. And um, I'm about to eat, enjoy myself for a sec because I've been running around all day. Before I head upstairs, take a shower, show you all my goodies. Give me a sec. I'm also uploading a Zara little basic shine haul on TikTok right now. I'm editing that, so that's gonna go up in a few minutes.
Good morning and happy Wednesday, February 2nd. I am on my way to my cosmetic appointment. Um, I'm deciding still if I'm going to add a little bit of lip filler to my top lip just because I feel like everything kind of has gone away now and I want to just balance it out with my bottom lip because you know, guys know I had got my bottom lip done right before my birthday. <coughs> but I don't know, we'll see what she says, what she recommends. I may not even want to really get any filler. I might just get another lip flip and then also put some Botox up here on my Cupid's bow. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna get anything in my forehead yet for my Botox. I'm gonna definitely still creases up there and wrinkles, um, but it's not terrible. I don't know, I might just get it touched up while I'm there. Um, and then I am going to see about possibly some thing to snatch up this jaw because I feel like since I've gotten chin filler, it kind of makes me look like my ch like under here is just fat and it's not. I think it's just because the filler and the chin is so sharp that it just goes from the chin down to my neck. So it's like my chin is snatched, but this part isn't. I don't know, she said something about like shadow something last time. So I don't know, but we'll see what she says, what she does. But I'm on my way there right now. It's currently raining, it's um, 52 degrees outside. I just threw on this hat because I washed my hair last night. So it's curly, looking a mess right now. And yeah, I just threw on a hat. I have on literally this workout zip up jacket I got from Amazon, which I love. And we'll be purchasing more colors. I will leave the link for you guys. Um, it's just a perfect black zip up jacket super affordable i think it was like 25 bucks maybe 22 don't remember but they had so many different colors mine is in a size small it also comes with the thumb holes so yeah um and then i also just have on just some slides <laughs> so just my adidas slides i really should have put on sneakers because it's raining but i was didn't even think i was just just threw something on to run out the house so yeah, I'm on my way there and I will catch y'all at my appointment. So I'm here at my appointment, y'all. I took my hat off, got my little clip. We're gonna see what we're gonna do today. I already got my jaw and lips are numbing right now. So we'll see what we get. My hair looks so crazy, y'all. Literally rolled out of bed and didn't do nothing to it. Curls are looking. My little new hair over here is so funny looking. Oh my lips are numb numb. Uh -huh. Let's get all this stuff off yeah. Your job is to breathe. Yes. And you did everything already. Mm -hmm. No. Um, I, well, well, I did the full about, half syringe. And then you did uh -huh. the cupids. And a the, little whatever I had left, I kind of just put it right And you in didn't the do the lip flip, right? No. Okay. Even if the volume is not where you want it to, it to be, yes, it'll be enough to carry you until you come back. Okay. Yeah. All right. So relax your hand on the back of that chair. This is your lip flip. Now 
just drop a little bit in your chin. Okay. I, I just can't wait for the chin. Yeah, you wanted to do this last time. I did. <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's like a kid getting a kid. I'm Christmas. sorry. I'm always like so back and forth with you, but. I know. This has to, like, this is going to make my day. No, I have to stalk your page mm -hmm. and watch you talk <laughs> so I can see it. I think I told one of my clients that, and she was like, um, so what have you been thinking when you were watching me? I was like, girl, that was just that one thing I wanted to do for you that I watched. I yeah. Just like, watch your watch page. Watch your page. So I'm back home, you guys, and my power is out. I literally was making me some lunch, and my power just went out, and I'm like, what's going on? And apparently there's a power outage. So, and they're talking about not until... 9 p.m. and it's like five and i'm like i got all this food i don't got time for this because y'all already know what happened y'all already know what happened with when my refrigerator was broke i had to get rid of all of my food so you know i definitely feel like i will be okay if the power comes on at nine hopefully it comes on before my freezer is so full i can't even close it um what was I about to say? So yeah, I'm just <laughs> sad about that and I'm starving. Came home, got comfy and everything. So I'm about to go to Kayla's house. Me and Lily are about to go to Kayla's house. It's so crazy, I called her, I was like, my power just went out until nine. She's like, you wanna come over? I, and I was like, yeah. I was making me food and everything. And the power just went out and she's like, girl, I just got done cooking anyway. So perfect. So I'm about to get dressed. Y'all really can't see my lips right now because the power's out, but I'm just gonna focus. No focus? Okay, a little bit. No, you can't see. Why is it not focusing? There we go. So they're swollen, but it's not too bad. They're going to get a lot bigger throughout these next few hours. So I'm on here looking so crazy. Like my hair is a mess. But it's because I took my hood on and off. So basically, um, Georgia Power calls me back. And they're like, it's only my house that the power outage is on. I guess there was a trip or something on the breaker. But the breaker on the outside, not the breaker on the inside, because I did go and like try to reset the power with the breaker on the garage automatically when it happened and I realized it wasn't like coming back on. So I went, they told me I was already on my way to Kayla's, just got off on the exit. Mind you, there's traffic, but good thing I didn't pass the exit to get back off. So it took me 10 minutes to get home. I get there, he talks me through where it's at. I find it and he's telling me that, that, that there's this like switch knob to turn and there's not, I don't see one. It's raining outside, there's a goddamn bush in front of it and it's a pointy one on top of it while I'm trying to look for the beaker and the breaker I mean and the switch knob he's talking about, couldn't find it so he's like okay well we're gonna send someone out there but he's just gonna be able to show you how to do it, he's not gonna actually be able to do it and I'm just like that makes absolutely no sense. How are you not gonna be able to do it? Like, aren't you Georgia Power? This is your job. Like, I have to be there for it. What? Makes no sense. So, I'm on my way to Kayla's, but there's traffic. It only takes me 18 minutes, and now it says it's 33, because it's 548. It's definitely traffic time. So I'm like, I hope by the time he calls me, there's no traffic, because it's gonna take me a long time to get home. But it's like, bro, you should be, like, you should be able to do it. Why do I have to be there? Like, this is not my job. And I'm already frustrated because now that it's taking me so long, another, it's literally taking me double time to get to her. I'm hungry. I just try to pull up to Starbucks and get me a little snack. They didn't have nothing. No, they're out of all pastries, all banana, all the loaves. They didn't even have a cake pop. And I was gonna get a um, croissant, just a plain croissant. I'm like, there's three cars ahead of me. I'm like, I'm not even waiting for this. I need to get on the road anyways to her house. Kayla made food anyways. I'm hungry. I just, was like 30 some minutes. I need a snack, something I literally haven't ate all day. 
so I'm just like, is this a bad day for me? No, we're not gonna say it's a bad day because I'm just like, this is just so annoying and inconveniencing me. Like I'm really in traffic right now. I don't have time for this anyways. Yeah, I just had to come up here and rant to y'all real quick. That's all. So hopefully I can kind of finesse him to be able to turn it on without me being there because, sir, this is just not going to work. It's not. <sighs> Wish me luck, y'all. Good morning, my good people. This is how I am looking this morning. Lip is giving fish. <laughs> it was so bad last night. Yeah, I'm looking crazy. Y'all are gonna see me in this robe. Y'all are gonna see me in this robe so many times because I just love this robe. It's just so comfortable. But anyways, yes, this is how my lip is looking. And last night when I was at Kayla's house, Last night when I was at Kayla's house, girl, it just got huge and it was just on its way up to the, the, the big part. <laughs> my lip just always, like I would say maybe like three, four hours after, maybe like five hours after every time I go, that's when it starts to really swell up. <clears throat> so I was just icing it, uh, making sure I kept it moisturized because lips are dry, girl. Because that numbing cream will dry your lips out so bad. So, yeah, last night I went over Kayla's house. My power came back on around 7, like almost 8 p.m. And nobody ever called me. I called them. Nobody was answering. I didn't get a response back. Um, and then I ended up getting an update, texting my power would be back on at like 8.15. I'm like, all right, I'm going to just wait, give it that time until like 8.15. But I ended up getting a text at like 7.42 around, something like that, that my um, power was back on. So I checked my cameras and it was back on. So I got back home from Kayla's, probably like 10, 30, 11 maybe. More like 11 probably. And um, she had made some food. We just chilled and talked. We hadn't seen each other in like, probably like a week. So we kind of just caught up. And um, yeah, that was pretty much it. Came back home, took a shower, I got in the bed and I just relaxed until I went to sleep. Um, actually, I came home and before I even got in the shower, I sat down, I had some tea and I was journaling for like 30 minutes. Um, so yeah, kinda just took it easy last night. And then today I have a private event to go to for Byredo. Um, that's at seven, so I'll probably get there like 7.30. Um, Cause you know, you know, sometimes, so you know how it is to just do certain things, especially if you don't have to be there like at a certain time, you don't wanna be like the first one there. So yeah, um, I'll probably leave my house around like 7, 7.15. And um, that's pretty much it that I have going on today. I'm really just gonna be like icing my lip to try to get as much swelling down as possible before I head out tonight because it's definitely a lot bigger than the bottom lip. So yeah, this time it was just a lot. I feel like it was a lot more painful this time. I don't know why, I don't know why, but lips it just hurt y'all. So, yeah, um, I'm about to take my ashwagandha, which I take every day, three capsules every day. And then, as I'm sure you guys saw, oh shit. 
as you guys saw on my TikTok or on my Instagram story, I'm sure you guys saw that I had picked, ordered this in, and I got this in the mail like two days ago. So this is gonna be my second day taking mm -hmm. this. And you're supposed to take one, or is it two? I don't remember. Two tablespoons, two tea. Yeah, two tablespoons of this, so. Not terrible, but it's not good either. Yuck. It just gives a, like when you were a kid, that medicine taste. I feel like my lips are purple. Cause we had a glass of wine last night. So yeah, um, I have my apple cider vinegar tea, um, the apple cider vinegar with honey, that one, the one that actually comes with honey. I put some lemons in here and just water. So I'm gonna just take my ashwagandha with this and I'm really trying to focus on losing a few pounds like between three to five pounds. Um, I'm pushing more towards five for Kayla's birthday because we are going out of the country on a tropical trip for her birthday. So bikinis it is, less clothes it is. And I need to be right and tight. So. Ooh, that one was hard. I don't think it was a good idea to take these with this because I forgot I put cayenne pepper in here too. That did not go down easily like it would have with water. Like I, I'm not that type of person that it's difficult for me to take pills. But oof. Not cute. So yeah, anyways, I'm really just um, chilling today. Um, I'm pretty much gonna be in the house until I get ready. Um, I'm trying to figure out how I want to get ready tonight. I know I wanna do a get ready with me. I don't know if I wanna add it to this vlog, do a TikTok, um, maybe kind of do both. Um, but you guys know I got a whole bunch of new makeup and I'm finally going to try the Makeup by Mario foundation tonight. I do have to do my hair. I washed it last night again, just because I did put in some products when I washed it the other night. That salt air shampoo, I am obsessed. For one, I love the way it smells. Like my hair literally smells so good every time I move. Um, I love the packaging and I just love how it makes my hair feel. Like the conditioner, for one, the shampoo makes my hair feel super clean. The conditioner makes my hair feel so soft and moisturized and I'm just like, wow, so we're gonna put it to the test tonight and see if it's a good shampoo that I can use on my hair when I straighten it because um, when I when I wash my hair and I know I'm going to wear it curly and not straighten it, I use more of a moisturizing um, shampoo and conditioner. When I know I'm going to straighten it, I use more of a clarifying or shampoo that doesn't have a lot of moisture benefits to it and I don't put any conditioner to my head. I didn't put any conditioner on my head to, um, yep, last night with the salt air shampoo anyways, cause I just don't do that when I'm straightening my hair. My hair just gets oily so fast and the conditioner will have it oily literally day two. Day one actually, like, it just won't straighten the same. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to see how it's gonna straighten tonight, but my hair is so soft right now. Um. So yeah, um, that's pretty much it. I'm going to be making myself something to eat here in a second. I think I'm gonna do avocado toast, or avocado I seen on TikTok with an egg in the oil, the onion, hot pepper flake, onion oil from Trader Joe's for my egg. I'm gonna get a hash brown from Trader Joe's and my avocado. So that's what I'm gonna have for breakfast, lunch, so I have to make myself a cup of coffee, but I'm finishing my tea. Cause you should really drink tea first thing in the morning. A nice warm cup of tea. So that's what I'm doing. And 
I guess. I will see you guys later. If it's when I'm getting ready, I'm sorry y'all. Today's a really boring day for the next few hours, even though it's a beautiful day. You know what? I think I'm gonna take my boo boo for a walk today. I think I'm gonna take Louis for a walk because I wanted to take him yesterday, but it was raining. Mm, it was literally raining. It was literally raining all day yesterday, y'all. It was one of those days, so. Today's a beautiful day outside. I'm gonna take my Louis for a walk, that's what I'm gonna do. And then after that, just kind of be waiting around until I start to get ready, to get ready for tonight, so. Catch y'all. I'll show y'all what I'm gonna make and how I make it. This is my first time making it too. to try it. What a, this is what it's looking like, y'all. On my paper plate, yes. I only made one with the hash brown. Cause you know, I'm trying to get right get tight, so I don't need too much potatoes. But I did make two eggs, so I already blessed my food. Let's see what it's giving. Really all in my face. Mmm. Nice little switch up. My avocado toast. Okay. I can do this. Mmm. -hmm. Quick and easy. I literally put my hash brown in the air fryer for 10 minutes. Five minutes on one side and then I flipped it to the other side. Perfect. And I did, I made my egg a little runny. Mm. So, perfect. Mm, mm, mm. This is great because I feel like I'm getting a good taste, savory type of situation, but you know, not too much. Okay. TikTok. TikTok been getting my ass lately. I must say, the power of the power of social media, the power of just social media is crazy. The influence is crazy. But I love that it's working how it's supposed to. Like, like if you have a brand, you don't even need to promote things certain way. Yeah, you just go on social media and promote it yourself. Mm. It is great. Anyways. Let me get back to my tarot reading. <laughs> so, me and Louie are about to take a walk. And this is what I have on. It is 42 degrees outside, so that's pretty cold. So, yeah. We're gonna take a walk. I've got my beanie on, my big jacket, hoodie, some big socks, and yeah. We're out of here. 
Right, boo? You ready? You ready to go outside? Come on. <laughs> I'm not gonna bring my camera just because um, I don't have anything to hold it in. But if anything special goes on, I'll just record it on my phone. Look, he's like literally following me. Like, um, I thought you said we were going outside. You ready? <laughs> All right, y'all. Come on. We are back from the walk. Dark because it's facing the window, but. I am trying this macaroni and cheese from Trader Joe's. Never had it before. And it's not bad for box mac, I must say. I needed a snack, I'm not gonna eat it all. But I needed a little snack. This isn't healthy at all, but super easy. Popped it in there for six minutes. If you know me, you know I'm a macaroni and cheese girl. Macaroni and cheese by itself. I don't need any other, anything else to eat with it. Mm. Our walk was good. It's cold outside, but I was very bundled up. I started sweating, y'all. That Balenciaga black coat is so thick. I really didn't even need to wear the hoodie, but I was nice and warm. I was not cold and uncomfortable. We had a good little walk. So now I'm about to just chill on the couch. It's already five. I'm about to chill on the couch until about 5.30. Start getting ready. I'm still deciding if I'm straightening my hair or if I'm just wearing a button, honestly, now. We'll see. But I'm low-key over the bob already, but I don't want to put anything on my hair because I just love how free I feel. I feel like I always say that. But, and it's just super quick to wash my hair and redo it. So I don't know, but yeah, I'm about to chill for a sec. Then start getting ready. All right, guys, so this is the outfit for tonight. I did, well, I tried to do a little swoop. Well, it's not even like swooping. <laughs> I tried to do a little swoop. Anyways, um, these pants and the turtleneck is from Zara. They have a little split. Jacket is from Pretty Little Thing. My Chanel bag. My Chanel bag. And then I have on, you guys have seen these plenty of times. This is the whole fit. Cute. And then my room is a mess in here, but yeah. Let me fix all those swoops. There we go. It's okay. It's not really giving tonight, but whatever. <laughs> so, let me just say, as y'all see, I look very different now. <laughs> um, let's just say that I'm going to get in my car to pull the address, even though I know where it is. But something tells me, you know what? I've been feeling funny about this invitation all day, right? Girl, it's not until the 8th. Good thing I didn't go and show up. So anyways, I've been ready. I went ahead and changed my hair because it wasn't really giving, to be honest, in the first place, I felt like. So I went ahead and did a slick back, but I haven't done a slick back with no baby hairs. Like, ever. And I'm feeling it with my little Chanel hoops. It's cute, girl. I don't have my pants on right now because, you know, I've just been kind of chilling um, for the last hour and a half. Um, fixed my hair, tidied up a bit. So yeah, we're gonna meet up at Blue. I don't know if I told you I was meeting up with a few friends at Blue after the event, <laughs> but now I'm not going. So we're, I'm just pretty much, I've just been waiting to leave the house to meet everybody at Blue. We're meeting at 10, it's 9.30, 9.27. So I'm gonna leave my house at like 9.45. Um, but let's just, let me just give y'all a little tea. This makeup today, y'all, 
I used the Mario by makeup. I'm letting you guys know that I've had this makeup on now for about, let me see. I've had this makeup on um, for about an, almost two hours. And I mean, I haven't been doing much, so it's still pretty much on. I haven't even had, I don't have no smile, smile lines right now. Um, I use a lot of new products and we're really gonna see, I guess, how it just wears throughout the night. But so far we're two hours in and it's really giving, um, my lip is still pretty swollen as y'all can see, but can we get into the skin? This new highlighter, bronzer, this whole new foundation, full face that I've come up with. And it's very, like a lot of the products were very hydrating a lot of creams so i can't wait to show you guys i use a new lippy and everything so i can't wait to show y'all it's cute girl so yeah um i guess i will see y'all at insta blue you know it's gonna be a little quick thing because i i'm probably not gonna take my camera probably not I'm just gonna take my phone because i'm wearing a super small purse i'm wearing my i'm still wearing the same bag that i was gonna wear tonight anyways the chanel but I'm wearing sneakers because, girl, Atlanta, especially InstaBoo, ain't nobody dressing up for that. So, yeah, I will catch y'all at InstaBoo. All right, we're about to walk through. <laughs> Today is Saturday and last night was very fun but it was one of those nights where we did not get home until maybe like 6 a.m. girl I'm over this like I'm getting too old don't recover the same woke up this morning I was like I have to sleep all day so I literally just got myself together wash my hair I'm doing me a face mask because I had two little pimples this morning and I'm like is it <clears throat> because I was lit last night so I took my makeup off I washed my face but I just washed my face and sprayed on some rose water and got in the bed I didn't even do my skincare I was so tired so I'm like I don't know if it's that or from the makeup by Mario, but it wasn't like a rash breakout type of thing. So, so far I still give the makeup by Mario foundation a pass. Um, right now I am doing a face mask because I want them gone. So, I'm using the Zipka, Zipka, let me see. It's a Zipka face mask. It's this one right here. Um, and I also have on, I also have on the Skims new two piece that I just got in. It's just music playing in the background. I hope I didn't get copyrighted. So anyways, um, um, I'm about to Wash it off now, cause it's been on long enough. Kayla's about to come over here. We're about to just have like a little girl's night at the house. She's probably gonna stay the night. Um, then we have our breathing class in the morning, I believe at 11 a.m. We're just gonna leave from here to there. We were supposed to go to dinner with Aaliyah tonight, but we ended up, we're probably just gonna do it tomorrow because we're all beat. Aaliyah got back in town at like 4 a.m. anyway, so. Yeah, we all are beat and just leave it this day, so. Yeah, I'm just, we're chilling, y'all. So, we're gonna have us a little vibe, watch us some movies, have us some wine. Um, I have this already pre-made margarita stuff. I might pull that out. And that's about it. We're gonna be chilling. Figure out what we'll eat later. As y'all see, my lips are bruised. Um, I have a bruise right here, and then you can kind of see my mom DMs me and she's like, did you touch your lips again? <laughs> I guess, just a little bit though. It's been a year since I even touched, put any filler in my top lip. But the swelling has gone down. 
Um, it's still definitely swollen, but it's cute. Y'all, that light I posted on my story in my car, I posted a little video right here. The lighting, the quality, chef's kiss. I will leave the link, of course, and you guys, if you haven't already, it's already in my Amazon storefront. I have been updating my storefront every single day. Every time I order something and I know I like it, books, whatever the case is, anything I'm pretty much ordering on Amazon, I'll go ahead and just add it to my Amazon storefront, so make sure you guys check it out. It's always going to be in my bios of pretty much all of my platforms. The link's there with all of my other platforms, uh, my Instagram, Twitter, um, TikTok, Amazon storefront my all my other links so be sure to check them out and always check them out because they are always being updated so yeah oh, feels good to just not do anything today great so i'll catch y'all when k gets here happy saturday still waiting for kayla to get here she says she's gonna be here at 7 30 it's 802 but she is bringing me food. We're having kava for dinner because I know I did not feel like cooking. That's for sure. I'm about to have me a nice little fizzy. I think she might have just pulled up. I was gonna make me matcha, but I said I'm about to eat kava, so let me not. My hair, this is the straight pieces from when I dyed it blonde. I'm just like, <laughs> everywhere else is perfectly fine. This isn't even how curly my hair could really get, but just wash it and let it air dry. I didn't put too much product in it. My hair is really soft right now. It smells great. I look like shit, y'all. I look crazy. Kaba it is. Mm, my I'm favorite that excited. Is. I was like, wait, Kaba's across the street from Bruce. I love the Persian. So what'd you Cucumber. do with the other table? It's downstairs in my guest room. Oh, okay. Yeah. Ooh, what are you putting yours? Um, you got those spicy sriracha. No, I normally do. No, I normally change it up, but I just got um chicken. Oh, me so, too. I just got chicken. Yeah, but I got rice, mm -hmm. arugula, oh, sorry. Um, hummus. Tzatziki, garlic sauce, Persian onions. Which tzatziki do you get? The lemon herb or the uh, I've been switching. Me too. I love both of them. Like today, I was like, what am I feeling like? But I love the Persian cucumber. The girl. The gar the, so do you ever get the jalapeno sauce? Because I get it. This green no. sauce? Oh, bitch. It's so good. Let me try. Oh, it's not spicy? No. But it's like a jalapeno blend. It's so good. Wow. Yeah. I get garlic, yeah, the garlic, and that, the garlic, the garlic and the green jalapeno sauce is like orgasm, yeah. like foodgasm. <laughs> yes. But, I also, I began half the chicken and then half of the roasted veggies. I love the, like, it comes with Brussels sprouts um, and, like, um, cauliflower. Mm. They didn't have the, the lettuce that I wanted. I just realized they didn't put any honey mm. greens. Yeah. They always run out of the um, romaine. Mm hmm. I never get it though. Huh? Mm. I like the lamb, but sometimes I need it to be cooked more. I'll be feeling like you need to be cooked more. The inside of the lamb? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look at me down in my eye. We went out with the hot girls last night. It was terrible. But we was really chill. I actually woke up feeling amazing. I woke up and was like, I was like, happy. I was like, wow. Ah! I feel so I was great. tired though. <laughs> I was really tired. Oh yeah. I haven't slept today. Oh my god. Like, I was really tired. Mm. They must be crushing up the jalapenos in this one because it is a little spicy. I didn't even know they had that. Me either. I didn't know what it was, so one of the, the girls who worked in there, this black girl was like, they had that option on the app? Mm -hmm. It's called show or sh show or something. I said it's green. Mm -hmm. I think I've seen it. But yeah, one, oh, I love the lights over there. 
Wow, I really like that. And you can do a brighter, lighter. I have it on the warmer light. You can do can cooler you make colors. Mm -mm. But with that light bulb, I can't have the lamp. I mean, being around these guys, yeah. I have the um, plugs. I mean, the light bulbs that are connected to my phone. So, like, when I'm out, I, I don't have a man in the next year. And I'm not moving into a house. I feel like I'm gonna just pay an interior designer to like come and really like. When I get make my yeah. house into like a grown person's house mm -hmm. next year, because I don't care to do it. <laughs> no, I won't do it. It's, you don't like stuff like that, anyways. And I do, but it's still very overwhelming. You see, I still haven't even finished. Like, yeah, and I like my shit done. Yeah, look, I've been here a year. Yeah, my mom's like, you should like take her time, and like, I want to move in, and it's just ready. done. Yeah. Wait, this is still playing in my car? Is my car on? I'm like, wait, what? Somebody took the whip. I'm not even going to stop. Yeah, that would have been a whole different beast of me, like just being crazy. Wow, my car was literally light and everything. Yeah, wow. Well, at least you don't have to go outside. I know. And turn it off. Usually, my car, what I do like is usually if I walk away, it just locks on its own. Turn it off, Yeah, everything. Once I'm a certain distance away. Oh, God. This is not the. She marked it. This isn't the right one. You don't get the pita chips. Those are no, so I, good. I do. It's in here. No, but I can have pita chips. Oh no, I don't know. They're not so good. Oh yeah, I just get the side of pita by itself. They're so you'll love it because it's salty. No, they're like salty and like you know. I always get that. this. I never even knew about Girl, that. You have to. This is free. This? The other one, uh huh. The other ones, um. You gotta pay for it. <laughs> um, I'm here, I'm about to die. <laughs> Hello guys, it's me again. I haven't been filming these last few days because I have just been spending some time with myself. Y'all know I'm on this journey of mine, so I've been doing a lot of reading, research, and you know, things that I'm supposed to be doing on this journey. So tonight I'm actually going out with Aaliyah and Kayla. We were supposed to have dinner the other night. I think I told y'all that, but we ended up canceling, so we're going tonight. We're going to a new restaurant called Knife. My hair is dirty, so yeah, I just decided to do a up, half up, half down. It's okay. <laughs> um, and then this whole outfit is from Zara. Even the leather jacket, but I'm just kind of wearing that over the shoulder. These shoes, oh, I forgot, but I've worn them so many times. Dior bag and I'm loving this little fit, it's so cute. Not too much, cause y'all don't even be wrong to get dressed for real in Atlanta, but I need to stop, I need to stop, I need to stop. So yeah, we're going to a new restaurant. I'm excited about that restaurant. This makeup Mario foundation is a fire. Forehead is beaming y'all, cause there's no baby ass. <laughs> but yeah, we'll catch y'all there. It's not too far from my house, so. See y'all in a bit. I'm here with everyone. I feel like reservations are changing to 845. It's 9.06. So I am right at 9. I am 15 minutes late, but that's really good for me. So yeah. Super cute in here. It's not really crowded. I don't want to get caught in this, so I can't even talk much. Cheers. Oh, shit. Cheers. <laughs> Well, cheers with your out. water. I'm gonna cut it out. Cheers with your water. Cheers. Cheers. No, seriously. You're so funny. But have you ever had Riesling? Yeah, that's all I really like. It's like Riesling, but it's just. It's just like water. One, it doesn't. No, nothing. It really.
here. But today's been a great day. You know, I told you guys I haven't really been vlogging. So, we got some things to do today. Um, not really much, but I'm gonna just show y'all me kind of getting ready for my event that is actually tonight. <laughs> um, it's at seven, so I have to, I'm about to take a shower real quick, then I have to go to the post office because I'm sending off one of my um, older phones, or my last phone, one of my iPhones, because I have, I literally, all my iPhones I have are like hit off. So I'm giving one to my brother. So I'm gonna go ship that off tomorrow. Here's the update on my lip. It's still swollen. Uh, it probably won't look like what it's gonna really look like for another like, Mm, maybe like two weeks it takes a minute but the swelling has gone down significantly the bruising is gone um it definitely feels i feel the filler but that's normal for the first first few weeks so yeah um i don't remember if i told y'all on my chin but <laughs> that looked funny as fuck um chin is moving fine i don't have like where like it kind of like moves anymore right here i don't know if y'all noticed that before yeah, let's take a shower, take it getting hot in this room. So, happy Wednesday. Sending all the love, light, positivity towards you, boo. Mm. Top is Wilford. I wore the same shoes that I wore last night. And I have to be really careful with these pants because they unzipped. I had to like fix it. So I didn't even really zip it up all the way. Your girl gained weight, y'all. So yeah, this is the fit. Super cute. And I have my pink Dior bag to give it a pop of color. I think she's cute. And yeah, we are off. Push me luck with the zipper. Honestly, I don't like the bottom. It's too wet, sponges. I didn't even make it out there. 
I went double scoop. <laughs> Girl, mine ain't even on there no more. I done lost it. I think it's for decoration. The top part is good. The bottom part is just bunches. I have a, I have a Canon, like a G7. Can you hold it? Yeah. Can you hold it? Oh my god, I don't even need it. It's so good. It's good. I'm gonna put it on my island. <laughs> it's real. Oh my god, it looks true. I wanna get one. Look at one. Hold on, wait. There? Hold on, let me see. Well, cheers to our flower arrangement. <laughs> I wanna show you guys pretty much like a wear test of how my makeup looks after wearing the Mar makeup by mario i'm still really learning how to really set this makeup right i use a lot of creams and i feel like maybe using a lot of creams isn't the best because <clears throat> i just like dabbed it in i'm looking at my mirror y'all i just dabbed it in look at this big ass gap in my lashes anyways i use so much cream like dewier creams that I feel like maybe I need to use more like not so dewier creams with this foundation because it just gets like oil and I feel like it just doesn't set like it just doesn't last as long and I'm just looking like an oil ball I know it's back close but I just want to let y'all know I had I've had this makeup on since about 6 30 it's midnight and my smile lines were crazy, y'all. I had to like press them in. The under eye. You know, it's not as bad, but <clears throat> like it looks really good and like flawless and not cakey. And I don't know, it's something about it. It's just not getting like my normal beats. Like it's just not set, maybe. I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I don't know what I should do. I don't know what I should do. But, like, the skin is looking good, girl. But it's also, like, not at the same time. Like, this I would not wear in the summertime at all. Would not wear this foundation in the summertime. Anyways, I'm home. And my boo-boo is acting crazy. Anyways, y'all. I'm going to take this makeup off. Because I'm not going to lie. This makeup does kind of make me feel like I have a little makeup on. Thank you.